Nathan Hale is remembered as one of America's first heroes, a martyr for the cause of freedom during the Revolutionary War. Born in 1755 in Coventry, Connecticut, Nathan Hale was the sixth of 12 children. He was educated at Yale College, where he studied literature and the classics. He graduated in 1773 and became a teacher after graduation. He taught in East Haddam, Connecticut, and in New London, Connecticut, before the Revolutionary War, and was known for his strong sense of morality and commitment to education. When the Revolutionary War broke out, Nathan Hale felt a strong sense of duty to his country and joined the Continental Army. He was appointed as a first lieutenant and was soon put in charge of a company of men. Nathan Hale was known for his courage and leadership abilities and quickly rose through the ranks. He fought in several battles, including the Battle of Long Island, where he distinguished himself as a brave and capable officer. He was also present at the Battle of Harlem Heights and the Battle of White Plains. In September of 1776, Nathan Hale and his men were sent to New York City to help defend against a British invasion. Despite their best efforts, the city fell to the British and Nathan Hale was captured. The British were on a mission to gather intelligence and Nathan Hale was believed to have been posing as a Dutch schoolmaster but he was recognized as an officer and was hanged on September 22, 1776, at the age of 21. What many people don't know is that Nathan Hale was also an undercover spy for the Continental Army. He was tasked with infiltrating the British lines and gathering information about their plans and movements. It was his mission as a spy that led to his capture and eventual execution. At the time, spying was considered a dishonorable activity, and Nathan Hale knew that the risk of being caught was high. Nevertheless, he volunteered for the mission without hesitation, motivated by his sense of duty and love for his country. Nathan Hale's execution made him a martyr for the Patriot cause, and his last words, I only regret that I have but one life to lose for my country, have become legendary. His sacrifice served as an inspiration to his fellow soldiers, and his legacy continues to be honored to this day. After Nathan Hale's death, his memory was kept alive by his fellow soldiers who considered him a hero. General George Washington, who had ordered Nathan Hale to go on his spy mission, was deeply saddened by his death and considered him a valuable asset to the Army. Nathan Hale's death also served as a reminder of the high price that was being paid for American independence. It is said that his execution had a profound impact on the Continental Army, who were inspired by his courage and selflessness to keep fighting for freedom. Nathan Hale's actions as a spy were crucial in providing the Continental Army with valuable information, and his bravery and selflessness will always be remembered as a symbol of American patriotism. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure to like and subscribe for more content and activate the notification bell to never miss a new upload.